Let me start by appreciating and thanking Safina's National Executive Committee. The ladies and gentlemen you were introduced to here are individuals who have stood with this party through thick and thin. And they have remained committed members of the party. Please give them a clap. <laughs> Second point is to say that Safina's wish from the very beginning one, the new constitution. Those who want to acknowledge accuracy of history will acknowledge that Safina played a key role in the struggle and the realization of the 2010 Constitution. We we'll remain happy about that. But more importantly, as far as Safina is concerned, the 2010 Constitution was not and is not a need in itself. The 2010 Constitution was a means to a need. The end being the realization of social economic empowerment of every Kenya. That is the destination we want to get. Put quite simply, we want every when we say every Kenyan deserves a chance. What we mean is simply that every Kenyan should live in dignity and free from what? No Kenyan should sleep hungry because he or she doesn't have adequate food. And if truth be told, there are many Kenyans who are sleeping hungry, true or not. We want every Kenyan to have access to affordable health care. We want every Kenyan to have adequate housing. We want every Kenyan to have access to clean water. We want every Kenyan to be economically empowered. Kenyans are people who are self-respect. What they want is a chance to work and live on the basis of Joshua Ao. See you. So we want that social economic empowerment. That is the business that remains to be achieved. And that is what gives me singular pleasure in welcome Jimmy Wanjiki here to the Safina Ford. So that is the vision he shares here. That is why he has chosen to join Safina. I know, and you know, that there are many other parties who could have joined Sibo. There are many parties. But he chose to join this particular party because of its ideology, because of what it stands for, because of the vision. That is why he has joined this party. And I want to say that we have welcomed him today. We welcome all those who wish to contest elections either as MCAs, members of parliament, governors, senators, and the presidency. We welcome all of them to join the party. And I, as a party leader, <laughs> encourage them, even those who want to contest for the president. That is a decision that is going to be made by the National Delegate Corporate in a fair equitable mind. But in the meantime, 
I call on all of them, those who wish to contest on the Sabina ticket, the presidency, senators, MPs, to get out into the field and begin campaigning. <laughs> the final decisions will be made by the national uh, delegates conference. So, uh, my good friend, uh, Jimmy Wajimi, Karibu Sana, some of us who have already said we will not be seeking elective position. But it doesn't mean we are retiring from politics. There are many roles that you can play even without being an elected man. Most of the achievements we made to us change this country. Those of us who are in the struggle that uh, my friend from PC was uh, mentioning about the electricity house. We did not achieve those because we were in the National Assembly. It is important for some to be inside. It is equally important for them to be outside. Today, the people who are actually standing up for the Kenyan people is the civil society. They are not even in the National Assembly. So, Karibu Sana, Karibu Tena, and I say to you, if you will be seeking a Safina as ticket for other positions, don't wait. The elections are in August. There isn't a lot of time. You and the others who may wish to seek Safina as ticket for the presidency, we want you to go directly to the people, Safina, who will decide for the National Delegates Congress who will give the ticket. Asateni Sana and Karibu Sana. Those who have been thinking that uh, Safina is there, I want to assure you Safina has been complying with the requirements of the Political Parties Act. We've got branches require over 25 active branches across the entire country. We've got membership, we've complied with the law regarding uh, political parties. And yes, there are many parties which have come and go. We fought and sacrificed because of multi-partisan. And that is something we hold dear. So we are not going to agree to be swallowed and that sort of thing. No, no, no. Any other party that shares in our ideals, we can share on issue by issue basis. But we will remain, Safina, with our vision and with our ideals. The one about when you go to the city, when the city is going to be a good thing, there comes a time when you go to go and refurbish the ship in dry docks before relaunching it. And to me, Maliza, you are a good thing. Sasa Safina is a good thing. And then, when you go to the city, Kiona siba amenyeshewa usije ukafikiri yeye ni baka. Toherini na karibu sana all of you for coming for this important occasion. I thank you. So My pleasure now to invite uh, Jimmy Wanjige who is a man of courage, a man of commitment. Jimmy Wanjige is your mutu wa kupabaisho, na hata nyi mumejione asido. Kwa hivu akichukua musimamu, you can take it to the bank. He is not going to change. He's got experience, he's interactive, and he now knows I was teaching him the other day, kila mwenja wetu, Na hile yo anaita Damascus eh, moment. Sidiyo. Na yake imefika. Simimona kwa kazeza. So his commitment, I am satisfied. Satisfied. He is completely done. Karibu sana.